In the last video, we create our first Android Studio project. In this episode, we learn about how to test this application. You can test an Android application in two ways. You can test the application using an Android virtual device or you can use a real device for testing. In this video, I will show you how to create an Android virtual device and how to test the application on the virtual device. So first we have to create an Android virtual device. Go to tools and open Android virtual device manager. Uh, you can access the virtual device manager from the toolbar. Here it is. So now there is no virtual device found on this device. So I have to create a virtual device first. So create a new virtual device. So here you have to select the virtual device category. You can create TV, phone, uh, Wear OS or tablet. So we are going to create a phone virtual device. <coughs> and here uh, you have to specify the device name. I select Pixel uh, XL and click next. From here you have to select the operating system for the device. So here Android Q is already downloaded. If you want to use any other version, first you have to download the OS. Then only you have to apply it on the virtual device. So here in my PC there is only Android Q is downloaded. So I select Android Q and click next. So here you can rename your Android virtual device. Select the default orientation. I select portrait. And on graphics, you have to select automatic. So if you have a graphics card, the Android virtual device uses the graphics card for the rendering that will speed up the testing, testing process. And finally, click finish. So here the new Android virtual device is created. Now you can start it. So you have to use the play button. So now here the Android virtual device is started. And finally the device is ready now. Okay, now the device is ready. Now we can test the project. So for run the project, you have to select the play button on the toolbar. Before click the run button, you have to make sure that uh, you select app from the drop down here. Here you have two options, edit configuration and app. You have to make sure that you select the app from the drop down. And here it will show the uh, device name. Here we are going to test it on Pixel XL API 29. Now click the run button. Now again Android Studio build the project. Uh, you can check the build status at the bottom of Android Studio. Here it is. Now here the build process finishes successfully and now the application available on this virtual device. Here it shows some hello world message. Now we can check the icon for the application. Here is the newly created application hello world app. We can open it again. So here is the first application available on this virtual device.